Hello friends, I'm Detective Cameraman. Today we will discuss my crazy theory about G-Man because it looks like he hid a lot for us, and we will also reveal the secret of the main Astro Toilet which I revealed, and will show you today, and also discuss the release date of Season 24, with secret scenes that should give us answers to the questions that we received after Episode 74. But this is at the very end of the video, so I advise you to watch it in full now. Before starting the video, like and subscribe to the channel and of course write a kind comment to promote the video, and we begin. Let's start with the fact that I revealed in one of my videos and this is the fact that G-Man is actually an astro toilet, and in the past he was a commander, but at some point something went wrong. Yes, I assumed that G-Man arrived on the earth and began to capture it alone, but what if G-Man betrayed Astro much later and worked for them all this time? The first thing I want to start with is that Astro used to fight against the Alliance along with other toilets and nothing foreshadowed trouble. But in episode 60 they started on G-Man, and in 70 they declared war on the toilets, after which in 74 they already attacked planet Earth. I think it all started with the task of G-Man who arrived on Earth and began to capture it. His Astro friends arrived and wanted to call on all the other toilets and also enslave the planet. But at some point G-Man and the scientist realized that now is not the best time for all this. And they themselves want to capture all living things and they refuse to call on the main Astro forces. A contract was concluded from episode 70, but the Astros made this contract to gain time and call on the main forces without G-Man who now wanted to be on his own and join the scientist. In general, G-Man was glad that the planet Earth on which he is located is completely his, and the enemies are only an alliance with which he can eventually cope, and the main Astro whom he seemed to hate is not here. G-Man was sent with the Astro on a mission but did not want to carry it out. Of course, there were more devotees to the main Astro, and they still decided to plan his murder and the general seizure of the land. Since the enemies are now not people, but toilets who are stronger than ordinary people. Now they want revenge and, of course, the fulfillment of the original plan, namely the capture of the planet. Now, of course, G-Man may have realized his mistakes and realized that he couldn't cope, so he would have to fight with the Astro so as not to die, and he wouldn't be able to escape from them. In general, I hope you understand what I'm talking about because it's too complicated. There are many theories you can make about this, and if you have your own ideas about why G-Man betrayed Astro, write in the comments. Now G-Man will put on his old Astro armor and I've even prepared a small concept for you where we see all this, leg and arm fur, as well as his legendary Astro helmet. Of course he is no longer their commander and does not have influence over them, but he can definitely use their powers and win the new war. What about the main Astro? Something tells me that one of the main ones is Malo 07. In episode 73, there are inscriptions with the numbers of the episodes where Astro appeared, and one of the numbers is 1, and this is the very first episode where Malo 07 appeared. What if the events of this episode take place on another planet, and we see the appearance of the first Astro, and then this explains everything and all the plot inconsistencies converge, and we see in the first episodes the past Astro, and then the events are transferred to Earth. Another spoiler really inspired me, and this is a spoiler with Marlo 07 and Astro in the background. What if the very first toilet is the first Astro, and also the main? Of these, in the future we will follow the events of the confrontation between G-Man and the Alliance against the main Astro toilet. The character Marlo 07 was not revealed, and perhaps Mr. Boom prepared him to appear as the main Astro. Of course, these are all my crazy theories. But if he turns out to be the main one, then the whole plot will work out, since now it is not yet clear why the first episodes of Mr. Boom were about completely different events. These episodes might not have taken place on Earth at all. And then we started following G-Man's takeover of planet Earth. In general, these are two small theories that I wanted to share with you, and if you like this video, then I will describe this theory with even greater details and analyze all the old episodes to completely put this puzzle together. Of course, the events that will begin now will perhaps reveal a lot of the plot to us, and we finally, we will understand everything. As Mr. Boom said, episodes 74 and 77 will be hot and 75 and 76 will have completely different moments and will be simpler than these crazy episodes but they may carry plot revelations so that we finally understand what happened in episode 74 and why G-Man was previously the main one and why the Astros consider him a traitor. And in 77, most likely G-Man will assemble a new body and a big battle will begin. In general, now we will wait for season 24 and secret scenes 
Last time we waited for weeks and I think history will repeat itself and we don't have much to wait, according to my calculations. About two or three days and I don't think Mr. Boom will drop spoilers for the season like that, like these are secret scenes. In general, in two or three days it will definitely be clear because Mr. Boom can just rest or do a lot more scenes that will have to wait longer than necessary. I advise you to subscribe to this channel so as not to miss anything. Thank you all for watching. Bye bye everyone.